It's time for our Sonic Rider to watch. Ty, it's the guy who had first pick in the draft, Marco Aguchi. Man, look at this guy. He is he is doing it now. And he, you know, this is a guy that we always see that tries so hard and puts out so much effort. They turn back into his hand like that. He will open up with that outside leg. That was him aboard Stuntman Ray in the championship round in Atlantic City earlier this year. That is the bull that he has chosen with the first pick to try to go three for three and match the man who is highlighted in blue, Chase Outlaw, the only guy three for three. And JW with the score we saw, 94 points last night aboard Spotted Demon. Marco definitely paid for it but he passed concussion protocol and here he is. Well, if you can ride Spotted Demon to 94, this should be a day in the park, shouldn't it? This one don't even have no horns. This is gonna be around the end of the gate, has some good time and good up and down. We've seen Marco ride him before. I don't know that he's gonna be that 94 like he was last night, but look at him to push 90. I, I agree, JW, I think he's gonna be right around 90, but keep an eye on whether or not he can keep his hand in his four rope. This bull doesn't get as steep as Spotted Demon. Spotted Demon kept putting him up there, kept putting him up there. Marco has a little tendency to ride behind everything, and he's such a scrappy little guy. He never gives up, but he'll get a little bit slid back and put a lot of pressure on his right hand. Had he not chosen Stuntman Ray, you would have thought perhaps Pacheco would have gone with him because Pacheco, the last guy to ride him in Milwaukee in the championship round for 91 points. But Marco's got some designs of his own with that big money for the World Finals event title, $300,000. This was a very smart pick. You can see the bull, it looks like, trying to get a little positioning. Jesse, can you see which angle this bull is at? Yeah, he's just leaning on the back, but I think they got him pushed over. Aguche is in the zone. JW said no horns. It didn't matter tonight because Marco flew out of the danger zone. We're going to see a lead change at the top for the event because Marco's done it again. This guy's on fire, man. I tell you what, the way he laid it out against Spotted Demon, took a big shot, wins the go around. 91. Here he comes again. Stuntman Ray has a great day. Look at Gucci's head. This bull is trying. He never lets his chin get picked up. That's how you ride great bulls, Ty. Yeah, big time. And, you know, now you get this momentum going for you at the PBR finals like that. And, you know, we always talk about how important confidence is. And his confidence tank's got to be on full right now. Marco has already matched his best ever performance at a finals. In 2016, he went three for six. He is now a perfect three for three, number one in the standings.